It's your man, Shut Up Cole here from the beautiful Alexandria Studios yet again. Back again with a little B for episode 53 of the world famous Sentation podcast. We are remote and I'm not with my host, but they're with me in spirit. Mm. Oh, is, that, is that your way of throwing it to us? Oh, yeah. We've been oh, okay. doing it for 52 yeah, episodes yeah, before. Yeah, I'm, but... I'm the best setup you gave me anyway. Yeah, it's your man's on really DW here. Hey, it's your boy Malik, aka Debbie Geek and Leak. And it's your boy Darian, aka Clark Kent, and we back. How y'all feeling, man? Uh, feeling pretty uh better. lowercase b right now. Better. Lowercase yeah, feeling b. better with a with a little b, a little <laughs> like b. no big b's. Yeah, Shout no big b. b. So no big um, b's. yeah, we're y'all remote this week again. Um. Like you we said, we like to keep y'all guessing, man. How about to say we guess. keep you guessing? We're gonna do it. We're gonna uh, Never we're gonna know. stagger it. Right. We're gonna stagger it. Maybe next next time we'll be in person. But right now we are. Um, right now we're remote. But you know what? It don't matter where we are because we're still gonna give you that audio stimulation that you come to know and love from the hentation. So yes, I'm excited. Right. How are you guys doing? I need more energy. Everybody looks so tired right now. Come on. Yeah, I'm Gucci. I feel better. Uh, I'm tired of this nine to five yeah. life, man. We need this uh, podcast to take off today. Today. I need it. We're the sponsors. Damn. We're the sponsors at. God damn it. I what else do you want from us? Face and I am really disappointed. Dear Lord, I do look tired. Man, yeah. I gotta I gotta I gotta do something about this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not happy. At least you look like you ain't something. It's only four hours, my dude. Oh my god. Not to be oh, watching rap back to back. <laughs> <laughs> God, let me damn. see your right hand. Let me, let me see, see your right arm. That's that muscular. Looks on you. I'm a lefty. Shit, it's fap, not whap. It's fap. Fap. Yeah, ain't trying to steal the joke I made this morning. All right, I see you, Darren. I didn't even say that. That was oh, Malik yeah. said fap. Oh, <laughs> this this right. man, this man, Dante. This man, Dante looked in the mirror like, "Damn, nigga, I'm tired." <laughs> I'm, say, I'm tired. Damn. Like Aaron asked me how I'm doing. I just wanted to be honest with you, like, bro, I'm tired, man. I'm tired. Man, I feel like I followed the North Star. Like, that's what I need to hear, though, man. Like, you guys just be like, man, Brian ain't going to hold you. I'm tired. I'm tired, bro. I'm you tired, tired boss. It's a Friday of a long week. Yeah, man. 20, you know, 20, we black men must say when we tired and or sad and other emotions. Yeah, mm-hmm. Or, you know, right motherfuckers, are, motherfuckers are drunk and tired. I'm tired, boss. I'm tired, shout, boss. Shout, shout out to Drake. Oh, yeah. I wonder if Drake is tired. I mean, you just be rich and just go. Like, I see all these famous people who just sit on boats, like, during all this. They're just, like, on boats 24-7 because you just, like, you know, just take your friends and go on just, like, to the south of France or something like that. That sounds like a good life. Please listen to our podcast yeah. so we can do that at some point. <laughs> like, I'm, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Like, please. Listen, I don't, I don't, do I don't care about you. Love. Don't care about sleep. We don't care about good content. We just want to be rich. I mean, look, 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 God damn it. Can we just have, you got me. That's that's, that's, that's what the whole point of this is. Truth out. Say, we ain't even pitching no more. For real, for real, y'all just like put different suggestions in the comments. I may try them. I, I don't really What know. do you want to see, damn it? What's it going to get yeah, you? Help us, please. Help us. What's going to help us get the sponsor, bro? At this point, I ain't thinking about sponsor. Hamburger Helper could be our sponsor. So they won't. Hey, we, will, pretty we will have broken off. Hamburger Help us. <laughs> That's, 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 that's a great sponsor. Lower, lower your expectations, some like KB <laughs> Toys could be our sponsor, and they ain't even this. They don't even need this. No, I said, no, kind of said beef stroganoff. <laughs> oh, that's my no. thing. Beef stroganoff, that's, that's good as shit. That's some good shit. I mean, literally, we could just I'll just do a round table. We go and talk about our favorite hamburger helper. I like the cheeseburger, John. <laughs> I only like cheese burger on my burgers, too. but I like that. Damn, I like the cheeseburger one. one. Damn, my mom ain't make those. I don't think I'm gonna say one of my favorite. Yeah, man, oh, shit. Man. So I mean, yeah. So sponsors, listen, we will listen, man. We're we're thoughts. Get us lit, man. We'll, we'll do a lot of things for money. <laughs> what I'm saying, do we we'll got? Do a lot bro, of I'm about to say, tired, at bro. this point, tired. if it don't if it don't kill us, we'll try it. I mean, maybe. Really. Like me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Let's get into these get into these toes. And we're kidding, guys. We are we're here to give you the best <laughs> content. <laughs> <laughs> I want that money. You were supposed to. You were supposed to say that after I stopped rolling, so I mean, I gotta cut that out now. So, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm getting the sound. No, no. <laughs> no, 
No, fuck what are you talking about. No, I no, we're here for the money. So like, but yeah, just okay. I mean, whatever you guys want to see. Seriously though, I mean, like going forward with content, we do want it to be more interactive. So I mean, there are topics you you the listeners want to or the viewers on uh, YouTube, you guys want to hear us talk about. By all means, hit us up on the Instagrams and all the social medias and all that. You know, that we're we're no open way. to anything. I don't know. No but way. uh, let's get into these goddamn toasts. So um. Um, Dante, would you like to do your bit? You don't have to, because we are... Oh, okay, cool. See, it's okay. He loves it. Like, it's okay, because I asked first. I didn't demand yeah, it. you didn't call me a monkey this time, so... Yeah. I mean, yeah, if you had, I would have done it. The episode is about PC culture, so I figured I had to, I had to at least not be problematic when I when I pitched this this time, so... I know you don't mean monkey in a racial context. You just mean oh, it yeah. as I'm trained in perform. Yeah, right, got exactly. It. Performative, yeah. Still That's degrading, good. but, you know, got it. There's a lot of great monkeys in history, like Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong is really good. <laughs> really good monkey. <laughs> Shout out to the monkey and Rampage. Everyone <laughs> 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 Rampage. Also, <laughs> lots of great apes out there. About to say, I'm trying to think of you know, a boo. One monkey yet. He could be a boo. A boo is a, a, a great. He was a great monkey. He was very loyal. He could be a boo. Curious you got damn beef. Curious, Curious George. George. Street rat. Curious, oh damn, that's fucked up. Curious, Curious George, George had a whole. Curious George had a name. feature, but he had a feature film though. He a star. Did you watch it? No, but he had a feature, and he it. had a song, and the soundtrack for that went like number one or something on iTunes. Wow, they made songs about Curious George. I think so. Yeah, I white people love. It was like a one of them like weird white little alt white artists did it, and they they love that shit. So shout out to that. All right, who wants to get her goddamn toes first? I'll get it, Kragen. Let's get it cracking. All right, yo, so um, I think they just started showing trailers for yesterday. Shout out to uh, Dame Kaluuya and uh, Keith Stanfield for the new um, Fred Hampton uh, movie that's coming so out. So those those are not the same people. Like I'm sorry, no, I dude, true. I'm so <laughs> no, bad. Aaron, I'm no. so no. bad. All black listen, people. It's not even. Watch. No, right listen, it's not racial. As you know, I don't watch <laughs> movies, so I don't know who anybody is. Like uh, they both know. in Get Out. That is true. They both in Get Out. That's it. Maybe others, but get out. Wait, wait. You sure they're not the same nigga, though? They're not the same. They're not the same nigga, guaranteed. Which one was the boyfriend? The same from the same origin. Daniel, uh, is it Kaluuya? Dan Kaluuya, Kaluuya, one or the other. Is he was he was he was the other guy? He was the nigga. He was the nigga that after the the picture snapped in his face. Oh my god! He started telling him get out. You know, he he went off. Are they both fucking British? No, no. Stanford from America. Isn't Daniel? I'm sorry. Nah, he's, oh, he's, oh, he's English, British. I think. Oh, he's British? British? Oh, yeah. I think. Yeah, I think. All them yeah. niggas English, man. Like, they all like, got his Elba play Stringer Bell. Ever since, yeah. Ever since, he just, just Elba fucking yeah. betrayed us. I just, I just been like, man. The Wire. Like, he was in The Wire, and I was like, this nigga right here, man. There's a lot of British yeah. dude that play, like, act Like, the dude played Soma. He, uh, Martin Luther King and Soma. He British, too. Yep. I yeah, forgot his name. I'm yeah, saying, yeah, yeah. American black people like playing these. I'm say, are we are we good at acting? I don't know actors. I don't know white actors. I don't, I don't know. know black actors, man. I know oh, his John name Boyega. is Daniel too, isn't he? He's also oh. British, John Boyega. But Daniel Oyelowo, what, what was his name? Dang, man, I can't remember the joint. Is that the dude who played the uh, the big Q dude from Black Panther? <laughs> oh, him too. Juke. I don't know. Well, I don't I think, think he's he... British though. I think he's American. Oh, he? I thought he. I just assume all all of them are British. Yeah. I think I he stepped, is British. We he stepped all British. over your toes. Keep oh, yeah, sorry. Toes. No, no, no. What's that yeah, movie called? I got you. Movie called? Daniel Oyele played, uh, played Martin Luther King. I don't know why I'm putting the African accent on his last name. Not even sure that's how you say yeah, it. Yeah, why are you saying that? good. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel Oyele. I didn't think he was going to say I it I said, again. whoa. Yeah, my bad. So it, sounded, it sounded like it sounded right, but anyway, yeah, if, right. It had it if it had it phonetically, I wouldn't be able to pronounce it there either. I don't know what phonetic looks like, so you know, it's what it is. But uh, yeah, nah, shout out to that movie. Um, yeah, I, I saw the uh, trailer. It hasn't come out yet, but after I saw the trailer for it. I felt like going outside and doing something. I don't know what I was going to do, but it made me like feel like, hey, man, revolution's about to happen. Yeah. But yeah, so it definitely got me really excited for it. Uh, really well timed as well. Definitely a poignant movie that's well timed. Even though, like with those type of movies, you feel sad going into it because if you know the story of Fred Hampton, it's like I know I'm about to say. It's, it's really depressing. It's a sad, kind of sad story, and that's where a lot of that uh, whole Black Messiah idea came in and shutting that type of black figure down. Like and he was a young guy. I think I don't know how long how like old he was. He was die- yeah, twenty one, and did all that. Like was that powerful yeah. of a voice, and and had the government scared that he's a 
quote unquote black messiah figure and like oh, doing everything yeah. to shut him down. Like it's it's a powerful story. I just watched the doc. They have a documentary I think on Netflix too about um, because you become even more scary when you unite multiple races, and that's what he was trying to do. That little rainbow coalition thing. Yeah, when you start putting white people with you, then you're scary. Yeah, man, that's a lot for a young guy. Powerful young guy. Yeah, uh, dude, twenty one. That's crazy. That's cool. That's cool. That's, that's that's cool. Shout out to that movie. I mean, I'm not gonna see it, but I'm the shout out to that movie. Not, not that there's not a good movie. I'm just, I mean, I just don't watch movies. I feel you. I usually, I, well, <laughs> mine is different. I watch those movies, but like, it takes me. Those movies get me so riled up. I'm about to like, say I that, have to like, wait until like I don't know. I got to wow. Like, yeah. Yeah. No, I agree. Yeah. I mean, too. Like, I, like I appreciate that we have movies that show, but I just some just said you got to be in the right mind, like you said. Mm. And I just, I'm just, I don't like serious dramas like that just in general because I just don't like that. I don't like that feeling of. Oh my God! Someone die, or this is so messed. I don't like watching that movie. I like comedies, like action movies, where the stakes are low. I like movies when the stakes are low. Right? I'm very hey, basic. In the business, so. the stakes are very high. The stakes are high, but they weren't real. In the world, they're high, but they aren't real. Okay. But yeah, it's it's a fantasy, right? It's like you know, these people aren't real. Like, <laughs> fantasy to you, nigga. It's real to me. It's real to me. It's yeah, real I mean, fuck you talking yeah, about. I mean, I cried when Iron Man died, bro. I did too. That nigga was real. Sure. I thought it was beautiful. Sinead cried. We went. I was like, it's beautiful. It it, it like completed his circle. It, he had to die. It was beautiful. Right, we ain't gonna get into this. We gonna get killed. I want to die like that. No bullshit. We going down the whole fucking rabbit hole. I mean, like I'm just saying, like I would not like that. But I'm being like, your, his death meant something. It was for the an good. atomic snap. That's how you want to die, nigga. Nigga, he saved the world. What you he mean? Just his death to mean something. That's exactly. Crazy. That was a beautiful death. That's why I cheer. Like I was happy. Yeah. If you go out here and you choke on a death biscuit and red lobster, how do you gonna feel about your death then? Was it meaningless? Oh, hey, if I die like heroic. like what's his name? Vision and get my little thing ripped out of my head, that's the terrible way to die. That nigga like, never came back to. Oh, you just get your little get your little brain stem ripped out, like that's terrible. But that's all right, anyway. Yeah, nerd nerd tangent. Who wants to go on the Wanda I, Oh, and the goddamn Avengers, that's the most mainstream movie there is. I, they ain't no nerd shit. Like, uh, oh, comic oh, book man. movies are comic yeah, book movies. A lot of people movie. like their Avengers. I have to say. Oh, Alright, right, who wants to give her toast next? Uh, Who's I next? Give my toast. I give my toast. Oh, I can give my toast. Oh, oh you want to go, Emily? Fight I for mean, it. yeah, I know. Right. Oh, what are we going to do? We okay. gonna we gotta do a dance off in this motherfucker. I'll go, motherfucker. I'm about to say, you are going now. We're gonna flip a virtual coin. The fuck, how are we gonna do this? <laughs> All right, I, I like you. I never I'll liked go. you anyway. Bro, I said I'm gonna go, bro. All right. How many times you gonna try to take the lead? Yo. You ain't sneaking the second fucking time, bro. <laughs> just go. Shit, I was gonna say John Lewis. Fuck. Damn. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Wait, say, yeah. Say, yeah. Right, anyway, say it again man. for the folks in the I'm back. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. Excuse me. I'm sorry. So, yeah, I'm, I got out of character. Anyway, man, my toast is gonna go to uh, John Lewis. Um, if you're not familiar with John Lewis, is uh, integral part of the uh, civil rights movement. R.I.P. Um, obviously, when Martin Luther when Martin Luther King was um around, and obviously, um, you know the um, you know the Million Man March, things of that nature. Um, you know, fortunately, he passed away, but left behind a great legacy, a great um, my like great role model. And I'm glad actually that he was able to able to see like Obama become you know a black president. He was able to see his hard work go, um, you know, to fruition. And uh, I mean, from what I've seen, he lived a great life. And uh, we got to continue to honor his legacy and continue to push forward. Especially if you look at the media now, um, you know, where, where it comes from sports, where we come from, you know, us marching, where it comes from us protesting. Um, we're doing that because men like him were, you know, on the forefront, you know, who always had then, I guess, America's knee on their neck. So, um, you know, shout out to John Lewis, man. That's my toast for sure. Yeah, man. Yeah, RIP to the legend, John Lewis. Yeah, man. I'm going to talk about all the quotables. I'm going to say, y'all toasted up some powerful figures, man. It's hard to to follow up. God dang. I don't know. Um, my next toast is gonna to be for like a stripper at the stadium or something like that next week. Nah, you should be a serious tone. I don't get why. Is she working? I mean, <laughs> I'm about to say, is she working? Like, <laughs> she working I ask her, is she working? <laughs> like, oh man, I ask her, do I want it? Oh, no, Damn, boarded up, I'm sure. Oh shit, yeah, it is. Go ahead, get, get, on the right now. get the wings <laughs> on the back. Get the wings on the back. 
This oh, motherfucker man. rat club, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> motherfucker motherfucker yeah, ratatouille in that ratatouille bitch. Ratatouille in the kitchen. Watching <laughs> bitches on the fucking scroll on the fucking ratatouille man. in the kitchen. Bitches on, rats on the pole and shit. It's Making it. that pasta <laughs> and shit. The, 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 the legs. <laughs> They bring yeah, the cheese. Out. They bring yeah. the cheese out with the sparklers on it. They lit, dog. Shout out to the rats. Yeah, the, same point. the strippers got like sixteen nipples. Shit, wow. Yo, yo. <laughs> <laughs> what? Wow. 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 Well, not sixteen. What you get the gist? Shout yeah, out to no rat anatomy. They <laughs> 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 got it down. I counted. But seriously, uh, um, <laughs> shout out to all the uh, strippers out here out of work. I mean, well, honestly, if I was, that's your talk. No, no, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You, <laughs> nah, you, nah, you nah. might as well just, you might as well just move nah, down nah, south now. My toast, nigga. You know what I mean? You might as well move to like Atlanta or something or Florida because them joints, them joints still open down there. So I mean, yeah, niggas fuck down there. Oh, yeah, they definitely gonna move. They had to. Say, oh, I'm about to say, man. If you was working at, I don't know if you, if you work at Fuego though, I don't know. if you, you don't, don't gotta be you a main. Be. You don't gotta be a main event girl. They need people at six p.m. too. Oh no, man! Oh, you right, man. But shit, I mean, do you really want to be a? Sh- this is why we do never episode. We have sex workers. Don't ask like because that's actually a serious question. Like, like, what's it like to be like the the stripper that be in there at like six thirty on like a oh, Wednesday? Yeah, those are the ones that see me and say what's up. Like, I don't hey, know. Those are those that meet the business businessmen though. You know what I'm saying? Oh, they probably get in the NBA. Oh, well, they probably getting they, yeah, or they get sponsored. Yeah, yeah. That's true. Oh, that's that's true. true. I'm just saying. You might have been about this. You had a good conversation. Yeah. All right. Okay. All right. We're gonna have an episode about that. We're gonna put a pin in that. Uh, Darren, get your toast. Um, uh, my toast is gonna go to not quite as uh, black history historical as Dante and Malik gave, but um, I wanted to shout out the teachers. Um, a lot of them right now, a lot of schools across the nation um, are, are having to get like really creative with kind of adjusting to the virtual, all virtual schools or those that are doing all virtual, some schools are opening back up. So can't speak for everybody, but a lot of the teachers have already have a tough time, like coming up with ways to better educate the next generation, the kids and keeping them entertained and are, are, are famously underpaid. Um, and so they already on top of that kind of have to get step it up and get creative and keep make sure the students are learning what they need to virtually some some apparently is working better for for some teachers and some students that that virtual relationship but others like it's going to be a big switch up for them um just finding a different way to teach and some of the teachers and a lot of the teachers have been doing this for years and so they're going to have to adjust and have a good time to it i mean an uh, interesting time doing that so Really, just shout out to them, man. They're 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 like I said, underpaid, sometimes underappreciated. So, and this time they yeah, gotta no. go above and beyond just to make sure that we continue to keep this education um, going for these kids. So, shout out to them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, agreed. Yep, yep, yep. And tough times, tough times for you know, they just teachers, superintendents, mm-hmm. school boards. Oh, I can imagine that. That's crazy, craziness. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Salute to you guys. You guys believe uh, deserve it. So like mm-hmm. I've been struggling to figure out what my toes is gonna be for like all week. Like I don't like I just I don't know. Like John Lewis is a good one, but mm-hmm. I figured one of you guys would do that. So I just want to give a toast out just to humans in general because like this is what like do? dog. I mean this is like <laughs> what we do month what we four is? four or five of this stuff <laughs> of just like this. Just new normal. I hate using that phrase, new normal. I, I pray God it's not the new normal. I but like, just the fact that I mean, and again, like, not everybody has made it, right? I mean, like, you know, a lot of like, uh, probably one hundred sixty thousand people died of COVID, and so, uh, like, I'm, I'm seeing stuff. I'm seeing stuff from the CDC mm. saying like that, like, drug overdoses are up, murders are up, like, so a lot of people are dying. It's a tough time, but between that, uh, quarantine and lockdown, and just all the social unrest going on right now just shout out to just human and obviously i'm not talking to people who are like you know talking about people who are just like assholes and you, you know i'm not talking about donald trump or, you know talking across the fox news people but you know who i'm talking about just general well-to-do people like just shout getting out up out of the bed I'm every day pay, man like why you think got these bags under my ass yeah man like that <laughs> ass time, like, I mean, like during like this quarantine yeah draining I don't even think like, I don't even think niggas was this sad during a recession. 
No, like, did it. I mean, I don't, we were in high school, so maybe we ain't know, but I felt like thinking about it. Like, right? like I know, but, yeah, but I, just I don't think, like, yeah, it was just like, I mean, like, yeah, there are people unemployed. Time. There's more people unemployed now than there was there in that, which is crazy to think about, though. Like, that's just, I mean, mm-hmm. listen, man, it's sad times, boy. Yeah, and just the fact that we still out here and trying to survive, and listen, man, I don't know how much better it's gonna get, bro. I think. Like, this election about to be crazy. Like, I honestly think that this election is going to be a complete shit show. Like, mm-hmm. uh, with the, between the mail-in, ba- mail-in ballots and all that. Like, I, I'm going to be honest. I don't think we're going to know who the president is until maybe Thanksgiving. Like, oh, and that's going to drag on. Like, I mean, I'm not even joking. They're going to come through that. They're going to come through yeah. that. Like, bro. Yeah, it's going to be like bro, I mean, Trump, like, going to be the first president to get evicted. They're going to have to force this man out the way. <laughs> I mean, but between that and then like just Corona daily, I just think it's just a mess, bro. Like, I I don't know. I'm like, so the thing is, like, we're doing they're doing mail in, but like, why wouldn't we do like they had people going in for the primaries, right? So, why we gotta do mail in? Like, uh, well, no, you can still, still, yeah, it's a combination. Okay. I'm about to say you can still go in and do it, but I mean mm. they'd rather not have all those people because right, I right. mean you know because people you know during the pandemic and all, but like also some of those option now, I got yeah like yeah like some of those votes like the one in New York I think like there's like I forgot what the race was but there's like something in New York that it's still not been resolved and I think the election happened like six weeks ago <laughs> like and what was it Wisconsin oh, where like people were like up at we're in we're in the, uh in line to like two in the morning. Bro, we, ain't no way like that. The last couple elections where you know who won by like midnight, that's not happening this year. It's yeah, gonna be it's gonna be, it's gonna be a while. But all and, of, all we need is some votes to be missing, like some. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. To, I just don't. Yeah, it just it's just uh, yeah. It's all, basically yeah, my nice. point is just just toast everybody. Do something that makes you happy right now. Like shit, buy that. Buy that extra, you know, dress from you know Fashion Over. Get that Fendi skin care <laughs> thing. Get, get you that. a tail bag, bro. Yeah, there you go. If you want, just do something I'm nice for yourself, man. Bag, maybe. Get that extra bag of heroin, bro. If the if the dealer is offering <laughs> two for one specials, so, so we, we just said, drugs. We just said niggas say no is drugs. dying from 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 drugs. Oh, and you gonna talk no about no heroin? Drugs. No, the drugs. No drugs. Thank you. Heroin. Hentation uh, does not support bro. drug use. Heroin. Definitely not no heroin, bro. Send me a bag of crack. Send me a hot bag. Let's see it around the edges. Let's <laughs> see it around the edges. You're right. You're crack absolutely right. Burnt. If you're doing intravenous drugs, chill out. If you're smoking it, I would. I would just say stop. I would just say stop. But chill out works too. I don't know if you can do cold turkey. <sighs> Temptations are not. We're not. We're not yeah. authorities on drug use, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, we're not. Don't do drugs, guys. Damn, that's smooth.